Yo, what up everybody? This is your boy Food Junkie and I'm coming to you with a quick video to show you how to properly slice and dice a mango. Voila. La mango. Well, the mango. I pre-cut um, it in half so it'll give y'all a little bit of time. All you need is a cutting board, your mango, a sharp knife, and a bowl of glass. Y'all some of y'all may have seen this before, but this is just want to show people who haven't seen it before. And give you a little something different. I know the streets have been on fire today. The streets have been going on. While people are going crazy on the streets, I've been in this kitchen cooking. You see, I already diced up some mango right here or whatever for a mango salsa that I'm making. But this is how you do it. Basically, you cut down the center right here. Watch your fingers. You cut that side. That have done. Voila. Move that to the side right there. You cut down the other side. Voila. The pit is right here. Put that to the side right there. You grab the glass. You take the mango on the edge of the glass and you basically skin slowly pulling it downward motion. Voila! You have your mango skin right here. And you have your mango right here. Let's do the other one right quick. Real quick, you guys. You see how that's happening right now? Sometimes it's just a little bit that you need to catch on the edge. So you just basically come on the other side and do the same thing. You know. That's the skin of the mango. Got a little bit that's right there. But you know, I got it all in one fell swoop. Now, what I do to make small dices of the mango, I cut it in half the long way. Watch your fingers because these things are slippery and you don't want anything to happen to your fingers. No one wants to have bloody fingers doing it with mango. So you cut that top off right there and then you commence to slicing. Just nice slices, nice slices. Make sure you keep everything intact. Of course, still watching your fingers because you are working with a sharp knife. And this is, I turn it this way so I can have a nice little long balance for it. And then just basically cut in one swoopy motion. And y'all see those dices of mango right there? This is going to make a delicious mango salsa. And y'all see these nice even cubes of everything? How that works? Put it in a bowl. Of course, make sure you have clean working surfaces. Make sure you have clean utensils and clean hands. Of course, let's do this one more time. You see that's the mango slice. The flat end is on the board. You just cut the top off like making a little hat or a boat. Of course, watching your fingers. And there you go. From there, you basically make cut the long way. At least I do start off with. Keeping everything in place. Making sure that you do it in one even stroke. You don't want to saw through anything because you want to keep everything nice and intact as much as possible. Keep everything intact. Take the, put the knife underneath it. Turn it the other way, long ways. And then you cut. That's why you got to have a sharp knife. You don't want to be sawing through things. You see, one even swoop. One even swoop. One even swoop. One even swoop and one even swoop. You get this nice uniform pieces. You put the mango in the bowl. You done and you discard. 
That was just my example of showing you how to cut a mango properly, even, nice, little bit to no waste on the skin. This is your boy Food Junkie. What up, y'all? How y'all doing? And that's my example of showing you guys how to cut up a mango for my famous mango salsa. I'll be back later on to show you guys the meal that this is going to go with. While everybody's going crazy, I'm cooking. Y'all have a great day. Until next time, as I always say, love yourself, love someone else, respect yourself, and definitely respect someone else. Until next time, you guys, your boy Food Junkie loves you. Have a great day. And I'm out. Peace.